Welcome to Men's Style Fashion, an absolutely innovative show. Who are you and what do you do? Well, my name is Marian Pejoski and I work for KTZ. Right, <laughs> and what is um, your role? Talk us through. Creative director of uh, KTZ and... Um, Talk us through what happened out there. I mean, it was just amazing. No, what's the inspiration? What is well, it, it was it was a journey. It's it is the moment of the. We are big followers of National Geography. Okay. We love, ah. you know, we we love culture of old. We love tribes that are vanishing. I mean, we always try to inspire ourselves by these places and people and forgotten cultures and cultures to say they're dying. So this is kind of. We, we try to embrace them and cherish and, and give them a sort of a uh, an elevation of some sort that uh, in our appreciation. So this was a journey that we did like straight after the previous collection. We went to Morocco and we went to Marrakesh. So it was a huge influence for us. It was just a moment. It was a, it's just like a magical moment dis discovering. Marrakesh and the people and especially the Berber people who are spread all over northern Africa but they are such an old culture they have their own uh, alphabet and they 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 come all the way from Israel to Morocco so it was something interesting that journey of theirs that they have through Sahara and the desert so it was it was something that we find it amazing and very interesting and their clothes and the way they're wearing jalaba the men dress and in such a comfort and comfortable and and that garment what gives a comfort and and warmth but at the same time keeps them cool so it was kind of this kind of it was a starting point of this sort of magical trip and uh, we just take it on board but at the same time we like embrace and it, put other things like starting with like using traditional fabrics as linens and cottons and and all sorts of different uh, fabrics that are uh, made out of natural fibers but at the same time we always kind of we wanted to 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 put some technology with it so like that's uh, the fabrics were like lots of high and hybrid fabrics with like all of these new methods of development so in the same way it was like kind of embracing the old culture but we wanted to bring something modernism to it obviously kind of casualness and streetwear and and also like sport that we kind of we could also could these technical fabrics usually you use them in, in sports for for athletes and sports and so this is kind of like merging the two things same in like the two cultures so so that's kind of was the starting situation. Men's style fashion is about the man on the street. Yes. And they're going to love it, but they're not going to show how to, if they buy it, how to wear it. Give us three ways that they could kind of wear this in London or, you know, it's so funny. Well, it, for, for us, it's, uh, for us it's, it's, it's like sharing the dream. Right. You know, yeah. so we want to present something to tantalize you. Yeah. For you to, to for you to to have a moment of at least br I bring you even for a second somewhere else if I can. So at the same time, we all individuals. We want to wear as we want to wear, and and, and there's no way that we I can say or talk anybody what to do in their life. Enjoy and embrace life, and this is what I kind of my motto in life always. So yeah. we obviously can be like you can take it that it's overstyled, of course, but we're creating a look and and dreamlike. Yeah. But at the same time, if you see it, each each individual uh, outfit, there was a lots of pieces commercial and wearable and easy. They don't need to be they need to be styled in the way that we do. But you know, you you have the choice of do what you want with it. Can you talk us through just what you're wearing? Because um, yeah, it looks fabulous. Well, it's a bits and bobs of everything. It's always my, yes. my motto: something new, something old, something blue, something borrowed, something blue. So it's like it's yeah. it's my life motto. So I kind of like love to do things, and I, I enjoy other designers, and I wear different clothes. And I'm never really one of those people that anal. I appreciate and and always love to be surprised by other people's clothes too. So it's like I kind of yeah enjoy. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. No, thank you so much. Um, I just want to end up by saying innovation will always make someone stand out and that's what you have done today. And we've seen many events and congratulations. Thank you so My much and thank you. Thank so you.
you know. It's an amazing place. Absolutely. It's an amazing place. It was just like one of those moments, like, yes. honestly, when I was in Marrakesh going in Medina, it was one of those moments. Yes. It was like a magic. It was you kind of feel on a moment you're in a different place, different time altogether. And when it was getting that kind of dusk, when it was like kind of the night was falling, and then you kind of all of a sudden different characters and creatures are coming through. And then once I just turn around and I see this old man in Jalaba, he was old and frayed, but so beautiful. And it was almost like a 19th century painting. And it was like, it was one of those moments that like, I felt like I was in Venice and it had that kind of Venice feeling in Marrakesh. Yes. It, there's yes. like there's no cars yeah. and like I, I don't know, it's just it's something that it, 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 Yes, exactly. Yeah. exactly. Thank you so much. Makes our fashion I love you guys. Thank, Thank you so you. much.